Bracing the coastly winds, the Princess Royal stepped out onto the jetty formerly known as the Middle Slip Jetty. She's here to meet naval base officials and officially unveil the plaque, formally naming the jetty in her name. The jetty is here and it's ready. Well The 90-year-old structure has been strengthened to accommodate the 65,000-tonne Queen Elizabeth-class carriers. It's part of a £100 million upgrade to the harbour that has seen dredging of the approach channel over the past 18 months to make room for the new ships that will stretch the entire length. So this is very important for Portsmouth Naval Base because the life of these ships is some 50 years. So clearly the jetties, the need to support them, need to be of that sort of length of age, uh, of durability as well. So we, we've built these uh, structures to last. Uh, we certainly intend that they should be there for the lifetime of the, uh, of the carriers themselves. But actually we're really looking at infrastructure which will take us through to the end of this, this century. Well, it's a big day in the project. Uh, it was great to have the Princess Royal uh, to, to the naval base today to, to name her jetty. Uh, the ships, as we know, uh, Queen Elizabeth and Prince of Wales. So already there's a, there's a, a big royal involvement in this, and rightly so. It's a huge project uh, and something which the nation can be very proud of, but something that uh, in terms of Portsmouth we can also be very proud of down here. The Princess Royal has, uh, has been the Commodore in Chief at uh, Portsmouth Naval Base uh, for a long time and has taken a keen interest in, in our work here. So it's really nice to have her down to, to name the jetty today. World War II bombs were unearthed during the dredging work. The bomb disposal experts met the princess on her visit. She was also shown exhibits in Boathouse 4, a family attraction within the historic dockyard. One attraction is the steam cutter Osborne, owned by Mr Jonathan Spencer. Mr Spencer enjoyed the Princess Royal's visit. She was very interested in it, actually, being a, being a sailor herself. She, she's, um, uh, she asked me lots of technical questions, so it was very good. The vessel was built in 1896 and served Queen Victoria and Albert II on the Alexandra, the Queen's smaller yacht that took them from Portsmouth Harbour Station to Osborne House on the Isle of Wight. Chris Jones for That's Solent.